Hey guys, Chris here with Home Measures. We are at Lumby Homes here in Sumter, South Carolina. And this is the Appalachia Reserve 76, I believe. This is a very huge home. It is almost 1,900 square foot. Very huge. It's a four bedroom. Um, I believe a two bath. So let's walk on in and, and check it out. Wait a minute, let's look at this door first. This door is beautiful. You got your three, um, I'm sorry, your six panels. Nice brushed nickel handle. All right, so immediately when you walk into the uh, foyer area, have a little bench to, you know, kick off your shoes and Hang your coats and hats and stuff like that. Got your ship lap. And you got two ways you can go. So I'm gonna go to the right and then we'll make our way back to the left. So over here, you got your kitchen area, very large kitchen, and this kitchen island is is huge, but we'll we'll get to that. Cut my light on, maybe that'll help a little bit. Um, oh man, I love these countertops. Look at that. Now this ain't this ain't real stone, but man, it, it it's beautiful, beautiful, and I love the color of the cabinets. You got your uh, got your stove, stainless steel stove, Frigidaire range. Oh, I cannot get over these countertops, man. That is beautiful got your large double windows here and oh that's a <laughs> I don't know to me that's a bit odd having having that shelf like that that is uh, I'm not gonna lie a bit odd but anyway <laughs> um, got your large stainless steel sink with your restaurant style um, faucet <laughs> um, got your cabinets over here all around the refrigerator cabinets up under as well so. now this home does not have finished sheetrock in it but it, it's it's a beautiful home beautiful what in the world we got here oh big old deep big old deep drawers here these big deep drawers okay cabinets okay um all right come on over here to the i guess this would be the I guess the living room i'm gonna cheat here real quick floor plan is right here i'm gonna cheat real quick flex room slash dining room okay okay i was kind of thinking dining room but then i was like man this is a this would be a huge dining room huge but anyway okay <laughs> all right so over here is your pantry lots of racks here in the pantry wire racks yes i know i don't like them either but you know that's that's what they put in all these homes pretty much unless you could opt for something else all right over here in the utility room you got your back door washer dryer hookups got your water access and over here you have a little area here. Um, you got more more cabinets. Let's see what's behind this door. It's probably your furnace. Yes, you got your furnace right here. So probably right here you might could put um, I don't know a little small desk, a little work area, or definitely a little small chest uh, style freezer or something like that. All right, now we're gonna go to the right because to the left over there's the master bedroom, so we ain't gonna look at that. Now over here is your huge living room. You got recessed lighting in here as well, textured ceilings. Nice entertainment center. Let's turn back and get another view from the back side. Now as you can see, it has barn doors here. They simply slide. I was going to close them and kind of reveal it to y'all, but it, they wouldn't stay because 
the house isn't set up and level. You see it, it wants to keep going. <laughs> but anyway, you have um, shelving on either side. Let me, let me push this back. You have shelving on either side for, you know, home decor items, um, movies, stuff like that, you know. All right, so over here to the right, we have a bedroom. Nice large window. And over here, have a closet. <clears throat> a little smaller closet, and right there is probably your water heater access in this particular closet. Now over here, we have a bathroom that connects to the other bedroom. So over here you have your uh, double sink vanity. The same style countertop as in the kitchen. Double mirrors. Let me get myself out of there. <laughs> um, have a door here that leads into it from the hallway as well from the other spare bedroom. Now this is a two-piece tub and shower, which that's, you know, that's fine. You make it opt for something else, but in this particular model, it is a two-piece tub and shower and you have your toilet. Now, we're gonna step on over here into this bedroom. <clears throat> Again, you got a window. Let's get another look from the corner here. It leads out to the hallway. Spare, or the, the Jack and Jill, I think that's what you call it, Jack and Jill um, bathroom. Good size closet in here. For the size room, that is a very large um, closet. Now back out here into the hallway, right here we have a coat, no, not a coat closet, but uh, just a, a linen closet. I don't know why I was gonna say coat closet, but yeah, linen closet. And over here is your fourth bedroom. I don't know the actual number, but I'm saying fourth because it's at the end. Closet right there. Let's check out this closet. It's a good size closet as well. We can see from the, uh, the outside. Okay. Now, let's walk down here. It's like a daggum maze, man. Jeez. <laughs> walk down here to the master bedroom. Okay. In here. Double windows. Very large room too in here. And you have your barn door and you know where that leads to. Let's go ahead and let's not waste no time. Go ahead and check it out. Okay. We might as well go to the right here and work our way around. So over here you have your double sink vanity. Your mirrors. Um, the mirrors haven't been installed yet. They're laying right here on the ground. Um, I don't know if they came loose or what, but anyway. Double light fixtures. You have your window. And you have a little, I guess like a shoe rack or linen. You want to keep towels there or whatever. Over here you have a large walk-in closet. Wrap around wire rack. Right after that you have a walk-in tile shower, rain head faucet, and there's no seat in here, it's just the, the walk-in shower. Over here you have another closet, okay, so his and her closets, nice. Same concept, same rack around wire rack. And over here you have where your toilet is at, now there's no door here, but you, you could probably put a door in here I don't know and then you have more shelving so plenty of of uh, storage in this home and then you got a standalone tub and I'm, I'm sure a shelf probably goes there <clears throat> nice I, I really like this I really like this particular home all right so Let's walk over here and check out the floor plan. Again, this lot does not place their prices 
like Clayton and Oakwood and other places do, but here's the floor plan, and I know I showed it to y'all at the beginning. But again, this is the Appalach Reserve 76. It is a four bedroom, 1896 square foot, very large house. All right guys, well that does it for this video. Um, please like, share, and subscribe most of all. Um, yeah, that's what really, what really pushes me to put out these videos is watching the uh, the subscriber count go up and also the interaction that I get in these videos you know I really like interacting with you guys so you know get on here and tell me what you like what you don't like what you would change and all that good stuff and we'll see you on the next video goodbye